Hello everyone, welcome back to my Minecraft Yorktocast Complete Pack Let's Play and today we're going to be working on two more machines in order to improve the efficiency of our um, ore refining processes. So those two items are going to be the crusher and the grinder. Now so far, if we have a look down here, I've just been doing a bit of, bit of renovation, a bit of decorating. We built this last time, the crucible furnace, which uh, is fairly efficient. What we do is we uh, heat it up, and as you can see, I've heated it up pretty high here. And we stick our ore in, turns it into uh, molten ore. So we've got some 18 molten iron ingots in there. And uh, if we use the ladle, which I've actually got on me, we can pour some of this out into the ingot caster. Let it set. And that way we get to uh, take out four bars at once. And I think that will have been made up of two actual ore pieces. So that's decent, but what if we want to do this stuff like on the fly and we don't want to wait until the uh, crucible furnace heats up to a high temperature. It does take a lot of coal to get it that high. And iron ore melts at a much higher temperature than tin, as we saw last time. So we're going to create a couple more... Um, couple more objects that let us do this a bit faster. Okay, so what is the first thing that we're going to make? We're going to make the crusher. Crushing it up. So what I've done is I've prepared the uh, recipe for this crusher, so we'll, we'll get this stuff out of here. And the reason we're doing this first is because to make the grinder, we're actually going to need the um, Certus Quartz, which I've mined to be ground up into Certus Quartz dust. Uh, to be crushed up, sorry. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna use the crusher. So let's build that. So it's four cobblestone, four sticks and a furnace. Pretty simple. You can get this very early on, in fact. And we make the stone crusher. Now, bear in mind, this item, I believe, uses coal to fuel it. So let's try it out. Oh, bit of lag there. Let's try it out. Uh, let's stick it here. So if we put coal in, put a few pieces in, and then the Certus Quartz in the top. Is this working? Ah yeah, okay, so it's very slow. Well, fairly slow anyway. So we'll let that grind up while we get working on making the actual, uh, the actual grinder itself. So what do we need to make that? So it's called a grindstone. And I've started preparing the recipe. So one of the things we'll need is a wood gear. So let's build one of those. Wood gears are fairly simple. They require four sticks in a pattern like that. And then you get yourself a wood gear out. So that will be going there in the recipe. So we can actually start transferring this recipe to a crafting bench. So wood at the top, and then bear in mind this recipe uses actual smooth stone, which can be just co cooked up in a furnace. And all we need now is a certus quartz, so let's see how that's doing. We've got one out there. Okay, well, while that's going, there's another part of the uh, grinder that we need to create, which is... Um, I think it's just called a crank. Let's have a look. Wooden crank. So that's just made up of sticks, and as you can see, I've got some here. There we are, wooden crank. So what we do is we put that on top of the grindstone. And then we have a way of manually grinding things up. You have to click it a few times and it'll start to grind your ore up. Now that's useful if we run out of coal. It's also useful if we're trying to conserve coal, maybe to use in other machines such as the stone crusher. We might need to put another piece in there. So we're fairly close now. We only need one more piece of that. So let's just have a look in our quest book. So the grinder's nearly done. We'll get some iron powder out of that, which we can smelt up. Crusher, we've created that, so uh, let's see, what's this? Applying some pressure. 
Open up your shiny new crusher, put some coal in the bottom and some iron ore in the top. So in order to complete that quest we actually need to crush up some iron ore. So let's go get some of that. And that should be in this chest. Yep, okay so let's get three pieces for now. I'm just trying to conserve it so that we can use it in the other machines as well. And then once we work out which is the best, we'll stick to that. And uh, this is quite a nice, oh, horrible sound. This is quite a nice area to just chill and start things grinding. We can use more than one machine at once, which makes the whole process a lot faster anyway. So we've got th three Certus Quartz dust out of there now. So let's just start the um, start this iron crushing as well, whilst we build the other machine. So if we put that in there like that, there we are, our grindstone. And we're also going to need our wooden crank. We'll put this down next to it. Hopefully it doesn't start ejecting things into it. So here's the interface for it. We put in ore at the top and uh, we, we get dust out at the bottom, I assume. So we need to attach this wooden crank. And as you can see, I'm right clicking it now. And uh, if you right click it like that, I have just learned that it breaks it. So um, <laughs> let's make another one. Good thing that uh, it only requires sticks. Unfortunately, they're all the way over here. Let's get a bunch out because uh, I'll end up breaking it. So I think the reason that happened is because there was nothing in it. Pretty sure that's the reason. We'll test it anyway, it's a, it's a learning process. You're learning just as fast as I am. <laughs> Probably faster, you might have already known that. And uh, In which case you're just laughing your head off at me now. That's fine. Okay, so let's not touch that until we've got some ore. Uh, is there a piece in here? So let's. So this iron ore is uh, crushed up into two iron dust. That's good. Let's um, see what happens with this. So if you put it in the top, and now you can just keep right clicking this. So it's it's put one of the iron ores in in the. Um, in the middle because you can put more than one type of ore in the top and then you can get a sort of chain going and you can sit here click this for a bit I'm not sure how long it takes let's see okay so that's pretty quick we've got two iron powder now let's do the other one and uh, <laughs> yeah so things we've learned well the wooden crank breaks if you run out of things to crush Fortunately, the only time you'll have run out of things to crush is if you finish crushing all the stuff that you want to. I'm sorry, grinding. Crushing, grinding. It produces the same... Well, it should produce the same type of object, but they've got different names because they're from different mod packs. But as you can see, both of them should smelt up into... Oops. Both of them should smelt up into... What have we got? Oh, yeah, I was... Cooking lots of stuff into iron bars. Fantastic, so that's two more ways that we can increase our yield. We've now got the crucible furnace, the stone crusher and the grindstone. So, what is next? So this quest applying some pressure. I uh, wonder if, yeah, I probably shouldn't have started smelting them. You had to submit them in the quest. That's not a problem because we can just grind some more up. And look how many iron ingots we're getting now. Brilliant. So let's finish these quests off. Building up quite a collection now. So, uh, so we needed two for um, for that quest. Do we need to hand in some for the other quest as well? Let's find out. Two iron dust for that one. And two iron powder for that one. Let's shut this door before anything nasty gets in. Oops. So let's put a couple in here. Let's put a 
couple in here. Build ourselves a new crank. I can see it's going through a lot of these. And let's grind these up. There we go, so we've got two iron powder. Oh yeah, of course you get two per item. And uh, we've almost got two iron dust. In truth, I think the stone crusher is probably the best out of all the machines so far, at least for what we're dealing with. Now I should say that the crucible furnace um, could possibly be used to combine two ores, which we can't do with these. Um, stuff like angmelon and things can be created using um, basically compounds of two different ores. There's our iron dust, let's hand in these quests. So we might be able to use that later on for that. But we'll end up building um, a giant sort of furnace as well. So let's, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, manual submit, good. And as a reward we get four iron powder. So that's that one done, completed. Crushing it up, applying some pressure. Manual submit. And again we get some more iron dust. And we'll smelt that up. And we're gonna have plenty of iron. So the next step is this, the portable, portable crafting table, pocket crafting table, good. So we can make this and that will allow us to craft on the fly basically. Uh, I've got rid of not enough items, what's the hotkey for that? I can't remember, um, but we'll probably create that next time. Let's stick these in the furnace, get them smelting. Got anything in here? No. Good. So we're making progress. And we're getting to the point where the ore is being duplicated into twice as many bars quite quickly, quite efficiently. So when we get onto making some of these harder multiple object constructions, it's going to be less of a pain. Brilliant. Okay, so I'll catch you guys next time. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comments. Like this video if you like it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next time, guys. Goodbye.